फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन गिव द फर्स्ट स्टेप यू विल यूज टू सेपरेट द वेरिएबल एंड देन सॉल्व द इक्वेशन द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज एक्स माइनस वन इज इक्वल टू जीरो वॉट यू हैव टू फाइंड आउट यू हैव टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स वॉट यू हैव टू डू यू शुड एड प्लस वन ऑन एदर साइड यू सी हियर यू एड प्लस वन वेन यू एड प्लस वन ऑन लेफ्ट साइड ऑन राइट साइड ऑल्सो यू हैव टू एड प्लस वन नाउ वन माइनस वन जीरो इट गेट कैंसल सो वॉट इज एक्स x is equal to 1 you get the solution as 1 the value of x is 1 you see you put here 1 1 minus 1 is equal to 0 so that is right now let us solve the second one x plus 1 is equal to 0 what's the first step you have to do you have to remove this plus 1 from here so what you have to do you have to subtract 1 so here also you have to subtract 1 so 1 minus 1 0 it get cancel so x is equal to minus 1 That is the solution. You see, you put x is equal to minus one here. What is the answer? Minus one plus one. That is zero. So you are right. Okay. Now question number three. X minus one is equal to five. What is the first step you will do? Yes, we have to remove this minus one from this side. So what do you have to do? Just add plus one. So here also you have to add plus one. One minus one zero. So what is remaining? X one minus one it get cancelled zero isn't it? here also get cancelled here also get cancelled okay so what is remaining x x is equal to five plus one that is six I think it is very simple now let us solve the second question give the first step you will use to separate the variable and then solve the equation first one three l is equal to forty two three l is equal to forty two what you have to do you have to find the value of l variable l So we have to remove three from here. So what we have to do? We have to divide LHS by three. When you divide LHS by three, RHS also you have to divide by three. Okay. So three three get cancelled. L is equal to what? Forty two by three. What is forty two by three? That is fourteen, isn't it? So L is equal to fourteen. Now the second one, B by two, B by two is equal to six. What you have to do? You have to find the value of b. So here b is divided by two. So what we have to do here to remove these two? You should multiply by two so that two to get cancelled. So when you multiply on LHS by two, RHS also you have to multiply by two. Okay. So two to get cancelled. What is b? B is equal to six two zero twelve. You see, you substitute twelve here. What is twelve by two, children? That is six. Here you got L is equal to fourteen. Here you substitute fourteen. Three into fourteen is equal to forty-two. Now let us solve one more third one. C. P by seven is equal to four. P by seven is equal to four. What we have to do? We have to remove this seven from here. Then you will be getting the value of P. So to remove P, what we have to do? It is division. So you should multiply by seven. So on RHS also you should multiply by seven. Seven seven get cancelled. What is P? P is equal to four seven zero twenty eight. I think it is clear. Now let us solve the third question. Give the steps you will use to separate the variables and then solve the equation. The first one is three n minus two. Three n minus two is equal to forty six. So first, what we have to do? We cannot eliminate three and minus two at a time. So one by one, we have to eliminate. So we have to remove minus two from here. To remove minus two, what we have to do? To remove this minus two, you should add plus two. So when you add plus two here, here also you should add plus two. Okay. So plus two when you add minus two plus two, it get cancelled. So what is remaining here? You will be getting three n is equal to forty six plus two, that is forty eight. Again, three is there. We have to remove the three. So what do we have to do? To remove this three, what do we have to do? Yes, three n you have to divide by three. So on RHS also you have to divide by three. So three three get cancelled, isn't it? So what is n? N is equal to forty eight by three. That is sixteen. So you get the value of n is equal to sixteen. You put the value of n here. What is three into sixteen? Forty eight. Forty eight minus two? Forty six. So the answer is right. Okay. Now let us solve the second one. Five m plus seven. Five m plus seven is equal to seventeen. Yes, children, you tell me what is the first step. Yes, we have to remove plus seven. For that, we have to subtract 
7 here, isn't it? So you added minus 7. Here also you have to add minus 7. So what happens? 7, 7 get cancelled. You will be getting 5. Um, is equal to 17 minus 7. That is 10 you get. Now what do you have to do? We have to remove this 5. To remove this 5, what we have to do? You have to divide this by 5. This also you have to buy 5. So 5, 5 get cancelled, isn't it? So what is m? m is equal to 10 by 5. That is 2. I think it is clear. Let us do one more. Okay. So the third one, 20p by 3 is equal to 40. What is the first step you have to do? Yes, let us remove 3 first. So we have to multiply 20p by 3 with 3. So here also we have to multiply by 3. So 3, 3 get cancelled. So you get 20p is equal to 40 into 3. Okay. So if you want you can write 120. Okay. Now we have to remove 20. What we have to do? Divide by 20. LHS divide by 20, RHS also you divide by 20. So 20, 20 get cancelled. Here 40, 20 get cancelled, you will be getting 2. Because 2, 20s are 40s, isn't it? So 2, 3s are 6. So what is the answer? On LHS we have only P. P is equal to 3, 2s are 6.